Right. <coughs> oh, there you go. First bit of talking to start coughing again. Um, hopefully it won't be too much of a coffee one, this one, but uh, I've got something going on in my throat badly. I thought it was a cold, but I think it's a little bit uh, worse than that. So apologies for any coughing or sneezing or nicks, anything like that. All right, guys. Um, what a day. Look at it. The sun is shining. There's no wind. It is a little bit chilly, though. If that makes sense. The only wind I've got is obviously what I'm creating, riding into it. Uh oh, here we go, doggy. Doggy, go and have a. Ah, oh, how's he going to react? Slow right down for doggies. Siobhan? I went to school there. Huh? Hi, Siobhan. Um, so, purpose of this specific run. <coughs> um, little Aaron. For the boy, Lucas, he's forgot his uh, dinner card for school. Don't know what they call it. Uh, no, I haven't got a clue what they call it. There's a specific name for it, but you put money on the card so he can uh, use the card to eat at school. So that's the purpose of this specific run. We're currently in Lansing, West Sussex. We're going to be going... To a certain school which I won't mention for obvious reasons um, but it is in Worthing so I'm trying to think the best way to get there really I think going along the seafront which means I've just taken the wrong road <laughs> right there's a tip then guys if you're gonna go out for a, a ride at least try and of some sort of plan of attack or plan of route. That's unlike me, that is. So can I go through something and cut down? Do you know what? I don't think actually it's too bad. No, I'll go through... I'm going to go through something village and then cut down through that. Don't you even think about turning. She didn't see me. She did. So, where have I been? What have I been doing? Um... Not a lot, to be fair. Don't know what he was doing. Looks like he's having some sort of fit behind the steering wheel. But there we go. So yeah, what have I been doing? Not a lot. Um, working hard. Trying to get rid of this, whatever it is I've got. Coughing and spluttering all over the place. Uh, I've been out on the wheel since... Did I do... Where have I been on the wheel? I think my last vlog was go-karting around that track which I've still got to get time to do I might try and do that Sunday so today is what is today today's Wednesday um, I should have been at work today but um, taken uh, today off for personal reasons and it's not to do with the flu which I won't bore you with Oh, traffic. So boring. Stop. Thank you. So, uh, yeah, the last one I've done was the go-karts with Lucas, which was great fun. Going to try and get up there Sunday. The thing is, I'm thinking of, though, it's going to be busy on a Sunday, isn't it, being a weekend? So bear with me on the... Uh, me trying to do the vlog around that go-kart track. <coughs> Excuse the coughing again. Um, but yeah, it is up and coming, and also Tillgate. Just trying to trying to find the right times to do it. It's all work and no play at the moment, which doesn't make me a happy bunny. Oh, have I got my vape? Yes, I have. God, I hate not having my vape. So I hope you're all well, guys. Um, thanks again for those that have subscribed to my post. But. Um, Please, guys, don't forget to give me the thumbs up on them as well, or the thumbs down. You know, I'll take uh, criticism as well as I do, uh, what's the other word? Criticism and, um, not congratulations, what they call it. You know what I mean. Uh, good comments, good feedback, this one. Because um, it all helps my, my future vlogs. Vlogs, even. Um, and thanks for the new, new subscribers as well. 
to my channel and just in case you're not aware I'm still a little bit new to this just been inspired by a couple of people to start doing it uh, for those that aren't aware I'm on a King, King Song I don't think so a King Song it's a King Song 18 XL and yet again I still wouldn't have any other wheel you can keep your M Super X's they're not for me and definitely not your Z10's I heard some bad things about them Z10's man not good not good things I've heard some good things as well but more bad things unfortunately from what I've heard um, some of them are being delivered out of the box and they don't even fire up and that's nothing to do with any lock code or anything like that they're just faulty um, which means you're having to open up the whole unit and start fiddling around with stuff and bypass this and bypass that that's not for me if I, if I spend a large amount of money um, which I did on this one um, it's just under two grand um, then I expect it to be working straight out the box everyone's being nice to me today giving way to me thank you uh, so yeah, I don't, don't know, Z10s, don't know, they've got all the hype and everything, yes, they go fast and this, that and the other. Also watched a nasty crash on one the other day on YouTube, they were racing, and do you know what, as soon as I clicked on the video, they are actually proper doing a, a circuit race, it was a speed race against two wheels, and I had a thought to myself, God, if I, one of them come off at this speed, that's going to work, and he did, but unusually, he went backwards, fell straight on his butt. And he didn't move for about 10 minutes, because <laughs> that's going to that's gonna sting your butt bone, isn't it, let's face it. <laughs> Excuse the sniffles. So where are we now? Something Village. Lansing, West Sussex. Um, so yeah, give me your thoughts, guys. Uh, let me know what you think, what I do, what I'm about. Um, what I try to do when I'm out of the wheel is a bit of, bit of everything, really. <coughs> The street riding. I'll try to stay away from the uh, general public. Try to. There's obviously times on my videos where I'm not. Oh, speed humps. Don't you just love them? Um, so, yeah, tell me what you're up to, guys. What world do you ride? Um, let me know where you ride, where you're from. Obviously, not your full home address. Have I come down the right road here? See, I only come down here once in a while in the car. Yes, I am in the right road. Well, I could have come down the other way, but... <coughs> Excuse me, the coughs, man. Don't know what it is with my throat, but I, I've had this dry cough for, I don't know, a couple of weeks now. Real dry throat. Nothing coming up. But I just don't have time, really, to get to the doctors. I really should be, but I've tried out, and I... And I say the word, probably give anaesthetic spray antiseptic spray anaesthetic antiseptic one of them all I know it was a spray and it ain't bloody worked and I also had some of this uh, lubrication cough stuff that my lovely fiance Stacy uh, got me the other day um, while we're on that note a big shout out to Stacy um, she's normally out with me but she's got to stay at home today to wait for somebody to come and measure up some fencing so, I've lost my scooter buddy on this specific run. But, uh, I had a comment left now, I can't remember his name now, but you, you, you'll know who you are. Um, we, you were saying about um, you'd love to get uh, your partner involved. Whoa, big truck. He saw me. Boy. Um, yeah, he wanted to get his missus into it or into the wheel. Um, I, I've tried with mine on the wheel, but she struggles completely with balance in any shape or form. Um, be it off the wheel or even on the wheel. <laughs> Bless her. So, um, it's going to be quicker going over that way. I think it is. So, uh, yeah, that's why she comes out on a scooter. Um, I, I just wish her scooter had done a little bit more miles. The speed isn't an issue, because I don't go great knots. Because I know it bloody hurts when you do come off at great knots. So, um, I normally go around 20, 24 miles an hour sometimes. I say miles an hour because we're UK. I 
they're not kilometers. Can I pull out there, mate? What? I could have gone four times by now. Go. So, um, yeah, to that, to that guy. Um, I did send a reply back about um, go, going for a scooter. Uh, my other half rides a. Does she ride? Uh, icon bit. It's literally spelled icon bit with a C. Um, <coughs> this is the double F version. I always get it mugged up with a double T. Double F's got a uh, little bit more gubbins on it, a little bit more oomph. It's obviously got three settings in speed, and the top speed does just under 20 miles an hour, so it's about, about 18, 19 miles now, which is more than enough for her. But she won't wear a bloody helmet. No safety gear, nothing. And that was even after watching a video of a woman trying one out and uh, literally face planting with her hands still on the handlebars. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. So, uh, yeah, get them out, guys. You know, there's, there's nothing, nothing better than going out of your other half. I don't think there's probably some. <laughs> or in fact, there's a couple that I know that are like sort that, leave them at home. But um, no, that's not me. It feels. Was it feel funny? My, my feet weren't lined up. That's unlike me. I had one foot, my left foot was slightly north of the pedal. I'd always try and keep them level because it's just better in general. Um, so yeah, yeah, try and get the missus out. You know, if you want her with you, get, get, a, get a scooter. They're cheap enough. I think I paid uh, just under 300 quid for the one she's got now. It was mine. Oh, anyway, didn't know that was there. So it's a little bit colder over here. Jeez. It's a little bit colder. Well, I'm going to cancel the video for a sec, guys, because I'm going to school now. <laughs> I'm not going to school. I'm going to the school. So um, I'll catch you later. All right. I'm back. Nearly ish. Hi oh, guys. Oh mate, the sun is lovely. Sorry, I'm just doing my lid up. I hate taking my lid off, but I suppose in places like a school you have to let them see your face, I suppose, don't. I? But anyway, going back a different route now. Whoa, tree, camera, no. I don't want no twigs and branches on my land. So yeah, camera, I'm using this GoPro Hero 7 Black, which is bloody ideal. Um, yeah, let me know if you, if you, uh, what camera you're using. I've seen a couple of guys that are doing their videos with um, uh, free uh, Insta 360s, but um, I'm lucky enough to have uh, the Hero 7 Black excuse me, the Hero 7 Black, as well as the Insta 360 One X, which is the latest Insta 360 camera. And um, do you know what? I've seen all the hype about both of them. I've seen the arguments, the upsides and the downsides. And um, I'm lucky enough to be able to make up my own decision on that. And um, for this, specific reason for like the vlogging side and the, the talking side of it and everything um, it's definitely this rings hands down because I can't be bothered to uh, with the, in, in, uh, the Insta 361 X or any of the Insta cameras they haven't got um, a mic import why why have they not got a mic import That's sad man bloody expensive camera and you've got no mic but um, yeah obviously that's more for um, catching your angles and stuff like that um, whereas this is for me for more more of the vlogging side of it oh nearly had him so 
Let me go this way. I'll go that way. Was it up there? I think this is a. Is this a close? No. So where am I? I suppose your class this is East Worthing. High East Worthing. So this ain't the way I really wanted to go, but I know where I am now. Uh, Elf's motorcycles. Been there absolutely years. Uh, a little bit hungry. I saw that burger van back there. But no. So, uh, yeah, I've done my errand. That's all dropped off and done and dusted. Could have just got quite easy come over in the car and only been a five minute drive. Sorry guys, just having a little bit of a, a little bit of a vape up. Hmm, I do like that. Bit of strawberry burst. Love it. So just going over East Wobbit Bridge, if you're uh, local to me, you'd fully know where that is. Uh, well, he didn't see me. Just where I see him. Been finding a lot just recently. Um, I'm having a lot of cars pull out on me. Um, don't know if you've seen my last... Was I videoing? I don't think I was videoing then actually when I went to put the car up. No, I wasn't because I said to him. Um, yeah. Um, sometimes you've got to use a pavement, man. Y you do. I don't like always being on the road. I like to mix it up a bit anyway. For many reasons. I'm being safety. You know. I mean, look at it here. Why would you want to go on that road there when you've got cars being like they are? Like, look, it stays on. I mean, that one's just turned in there and didn't even have an indicator on. So, um... Yeah, last week I had a car pull out, didn't even look left, looks right, which is the way he's turning, so why wouldn't you, why wouldn't you, um, turn, why wouldn't you look left if you're turning right? Why would you only look right if you're turning right? Doesn't make sense to me. Boom, boom. All the grunt with no front. Go on, Emma, love. Go on. <sighs> dear, oh dear. So, uh, yeah, just having a few people pull out on me and they're not looking at all. Um, you know, I appreciate that the world's a busier place nowadays, you know, compared to even 10, 15 years ago. And people just always seem to be in such a rush. That's my head in. Let's calm things down, guys. You know, like I said before previously, I'm a professional driver for a living. Um, and I just see it all daily. There's people driving like absolute bags, you know. There's no need. You know, if, if you know you've got to go somewhere, allow a bit more time and enjoy the drive. So where am I now? Smugglers. Smugglers return. Worthing. A few local guys would know where that is. Never been in there myself. Yes, I have to lie. I did a company drink up when I was at um, BMW loudspeakers. Bus driver is pointing at me there. I don't know what that was about, but... I find that these things in half get some, uh, get some attraction, don't they? You know, I've, I've had so many people come up to me. Um, you know, I'm the only one around my neck of the woods with one of these. Uh, tell a lie. Um, there is one other, but I haven't met out with him yet. Uh, I think he's been off with an injury, twisted ankle. Um, can't remember his name now. Oh, shit. Uh, what's his name? Chambers. Mr. Chambers. Um, Neil? Might be Neil Chambers. If I've got that wrong, I apologise, but... Um, I think it was Neil, to be fair. So, yeah, if I've got it wrong, apologies for that. But, yeah, we'll have to meet up, buddy. We are in the same town, after all. Be good to uh, support the cause in our local 
village. So, quite often come this route, guys. You've probably seen this in this amount of times. So I don't know if you can see that out there, the old wind farm. Do you know what? Shall I go in a Worthing for a bit, a little scoop along a... Yes, might as well. Yeah, see, I live the other direction, but I'm out on the wheel. So, uh, that's to be done. Don't know if you can hear my music. Hopefully, it's not too loud for the uh, through the wheel, through the Bluetooth on the wheel there. Um, I don't like blasting it out, but I do like listening to some tunage. Once I get away from these cars, I can hear it properly. Whoop. I've had a picture of him before with the wheel. So yeah, Sunny Worthing. Uh, worked here before doing security. I won't say where, but pretty much all over it, including a bit of door work, retail, events, and uh, a little bit of info just in case you live locally and you want to know and you haven't heard. They've just been given the okay for a um, big wheel, and I don't mean unicycle wheel. Um, you know, one of these big, do you call it a furnace wheel? Is it a furnace wheel? You know the ones with the big seats in it, you just sit in and go around. Yeah, one of them. Well, they tried it a few summers, summers ago in um, Steen Gardens. Not really a big fan, to be fair. Don't trust them. I personally think uh, it's not really worth it. There's a lot more things that uh, they should be doing instead of putting up a wheel. But that's uh, my opinion anyway. So in the summer, this is nice. I'm at uh, Splash Point now. There's a Splash Swimming Pool. Just there, Splash Swimming Pool there. And uh, used to be used to be the Akarima. So we don't mooch around here. God, this has all changed. She never saw me. So a bit of crazy golf. If you want to. <coughs> Excuse me again with the coughing, guys. Um, oh, duck for that. That was nearly my camera. Saw it at the last minute. Bit of crazy golf there. Yeah, look at that. Whoop, whoop. Oh, here comes the doggy. Doggy alert. Take a nice and steady. Is it going to be a nice one or is he going to chew my ankles off? That's a good doggy. I don't know if you can see that, but that's the, uh, the wind farm out there. I don't know if you class that as Lansing or Worthing. It starts in Lansing, finishes in Worthing. And I'm smack in the middle of it. So make up your own choice that, really. I'm footed. Yeah, baby. Ooh, a bit of wobble there. Check the feetage, they're all good. I've gone around that a few times, probably seen my previous videos. I like this ride, straight along the seafront here. Love it. Oh, those clouds don't look nice in front though, did I? I've only just noticed them. Don't you dare, because I've got that coat on. It better not rain.
good old shit coach. No, thank you. Got a faster turnover of staff in that place than Mackie D's could dish out burgers. True story. Oh, sorry. Right in front of her video. So I'm always a little bit cautious when I come up here because we've got some jobs worth um, Coast Guards on this one. I get seriously involved, they all get on their little radios and just does wear it a little bit really. Um, for me, uh, I think they do it voluntarily. So for me that tells me we're paying for it as taxpayers. Or should we go down this road Kev? Yes we will. So as a long-term, lifetime taxpayer, yes, I think they're a good cause, but I think if you're a coast guard, can you monitor the coast instead of what's happening up here? Because you can see that there's really nothing happening up here apart from me coming up on this promenade on my wheel. I'm not going a great knot of speed, being mindful of everyone around me. So just leave us alone. Leave the skateboarders alone, leave the rollerbladers, the cyclists, actually no, take that back, have a word with the cyclists, some of them come herring down here, and I've got mates that are cyclists, so I apologise for that little comment, but it's true, just had a bug in my mouth, that wasn't a nice experience, nice bit of free lunch I suppose, that's going to chuck down isn't it, fucking better not, it's weird isn't it, look at that weather there, that lovely and sunny and there not good at all so I'm gonna start heading back because of that to be fair I'm not gonna get caught in that yeah good choice enjoy the sunnage well so my fingertips are getting a little bit cold then yeah um I bought some mitts, <laughs> mitts, mittens. Um, I class them as mittens because they've got no, you don't put your fingers through them. They're enclosed. But the downside is, I can't wear me uh, wrist guards. Uh, and I much prefer to wear my wrist guards and I have cold fingers or fingertips than I would to wear some mittens, if that makes sense. So yeah, probably talking about a load of a load of plop at the moment. Sometimes I think when you're out on these wheels, you can, you know, because you're you're just out there and you're just having a wheel around and stuff. Just gonna sink that view in for a sec. Not sure why, but these sounds are coming out quite quiet. So that everyone don't know I don't like blasting them out, but <laughs> oh, excuse me with the sniffles. I thought that was my wheel bleeping for a minute. <laughs> it wasn't it's traffic lights. Um, right. <coughs> yeah, so we're in Lido. Are we open? No, we're not. We're having a little nosy, shall we? Been in here a few times. Ah, oh, no bouncy castle. So, yeah, kids love it here. Yeah? I think it's about eight quid for three hours. Something like that. Yeah, love it. So, it's now got a little bit colder than it was earlier. Probably because that sun's a bit on the cloud. <laughs> Do I really want to go on with him here? Yeah, 
Yes, I do. Uh, oh, just for those you don't know, just around the corner here, well, actually, all this bit here, and that room in there, that exact table there, 24, is where the guys sat that done um, TV series. It's a four part series, Cheat, it was called, where a uh, school pupil uh, went off with a married man or cheated with a married man or a married man cheated with her. So, just quickly, uh, signs here, no cycles, that says two wheels, I'm on one wheel, I'm not going to dive or jump, fine is enforceable, but how do you give a fine to someone that's in the water, so oh, no fishing, blah blah blah, well, I don't want to go fishing. Just want to go up to the end and back, if that's okay. No my luck, we'll have a job's worth. Coast Guard up the top. So yeah, just taking it easy on here, guys. What's the point in coming around, enjoy the view. This used to be Lush nightclub. Worked there many times. We're actually that at the top. It used to be lush nightclub. <laughs> Snotty nose. <laughs> Snotty nose. I feel like absolute pants. I thought a bit of fresh air might be good. Uh, it's definitely a bit fresh down here. Get out for a view, eh? The end of Worthing Pier. And then back out the other way. <laughs> His face was like, I don't know, it wasn't a happy face, put it that way. And I'm not too sure. I thought he looked quite angry, to be fair. I don't think he appreciated me coming up here, but there you go. Sometimes you get that, don't we? So, little view there of Worthing Dome Cinema. Also a function room upstairs. Should be able to see that from where I am. Fingertips are cold. Starting to think, should I catch the bus home? <laughs> no, got to happen, is it? It's not as if they're going to drop off. I can warm up when I get home. Oh, bloody black clouds chasing me, though. Look, that was behind me earlier. I'll try and get in front of that. That's to be done. A little smooching worthing. I keep saying, let's do this, let's do that. But I need to get back because it's going to chuck down. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I don't like riding in the rain, to be fair. Oh, people. Oh, they're not riding in people. Get out of the way of them. We're in town. I'm not going to go up there because I know there's a market on. No, thank you. Oh, strong whiff of glue. Very really nice glue, either. Delivering my wages, obviously.
and this is why I didn't go up the other way. Far too many buds. So right in the smack of centre of Worthing now. Vapage. Get some weird looks. 